The style icon herself, Miss Erica Badu, who they're referring to as the Almighty on the cover of the Cut magazine. Now, Erica is known for all of her signature style, very tribal, very Afrocentric, very funky, and very African American. I know many people refuse to acknowledge it, but African Americans do have our own unique style in these nameplate necklaces that she has fashioned into a headpiece. I'm definitely sure it was made by Ellen Chanchor is a representation of our unique style. And they call these the name spell crowns if you're interested in purchasing one. I also really admire Erica for only ever showcasing very black hairstyles. If it's not braids, it's something big, puffy, and fluffy. So I always appreciate that because you know, black girls, we struggle with our hair, boy. But her more over the top looks like this one are the ones that kind of speak and I feel like they will go down in history more so associated with her. This shot was so beautiful with the tear coming down. My God, it's art. And then juxtaposed next to this one is giving me a kind of evil genius look. I like it because for me, it represents the different ways a person can choose to be vulnerable. And the final shot, which is my favorite of the whole entire shoot outside of the teardrop picture is this one because I feel like it embodies Erica in the most simplistic yet loud way possible. Her sand in her power in all black with the tribal makeup the long braids is definitely giving me an oracle vibe let me know what you think about the shoot in the comments and please don't forget to subscribe